What's up? This is Ted from Pacifier. You're watching punkvideosrock.com. Hey guys, Robert Herrera here with punkvideosrock.com. Hanging out backstage at Vans Warped Tour 2011 in Pomona. Hanging out with Ted of Pacifier. How's it going, buddy? Wonderful. How are you doing today? Doing good. Doing good. I'm almost like losing my voice today. Oh man, <laughs> it's a hot one out here. It you is. Stay hydrated. It's not as bad. It's not as bad. It's been worse. Exactly. Uh, how's the tour been so far for you? Man, this this tour is incredible. Um, the the Vans Warped Tour crew, staff, uh, the from the catering to the people setting up the stages mm -hmm. to just the vendors and all this stuff. Like everybody's on one level. Everybody has Everybody's the same vibe, yeah. yeah. So many different styles of music, yet one vibe and one feeling. So it's a pretty cool thing. Yeah, definitely. To be a part of. So styles of music. Tell us a little bit about the band. Uh, uh, Pacifier is rock, reggae, a lot of dub, a lot of effects. Um, some meaningful, try to be meaningful uh, with our lyrics and uh, positive and uplifting music. Mm -hmm. Very influenced by reggae, but uh, we've over the years been evolving through different other styles uh, all kinds of like bluegrass influence a little bit okay. of uh, country sort of mixed with the hard like metal and uh, extreme dub affected okay. kind Do you guys of stuff. have any uh, any album you're pushing right now currently on the warp tour we just finished recording our latest album start from scratch it's gonna be available September okay. of 2011 uh, we recorded with Paul Leary, of, uh, he's the guitarist of the Butthole Surfers. Uh, he's, he's produced uh, the Sublime self-titled, as well as Pepper, Slightly Stupid, The Expendables, nice. a bunch of people in our scene yeah. who are actually also here on Warp Tour. Our scene is being represented big time big this time year. Big time this year, actually. Yeah, for sure. So, that's cool. There's not that much competition as far as like, getting the crowds over. Yeah, I mean, some days it is. Some days, like all the reggae rock, people are at the same time so it's like you know you kind of miss out how, with how having do you, bigger acts how do you stuff. like the schedules like how you don't know every band plays different schedules a day it's fun it's like it gets me up in the morning yeah I wake up and I'm like excited like Christmas like oh when are we gonna be when's it gonna be but uh, you know it like no no set time sucks the people are here all day long That's true. everybody's here early too yeah I hear people complain like, oh, we're playing at 6.30. I'm like, man, that means That's you got all time. day to hang out, <laughs> talk to press. That's a good time. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> what else do you guys have planned out after this tour? After this tour, we are going to take a quick break, and then we're going to go right back on the road and do a full-blown headlining tour supporting the new album, um, which drops September 20th. We're going to go out. I think the tour starts a few days before the release. Oh. But... Um, I would like for there to be a release party in Savannah, but that hasn't been discussed yet. Not yet. And uh, um, what bands will you guys be bringing out on your tour? Uh, we don't know yet. We we have yet to completely solidify. There's a few in the runnings. There were a bunch, and now we've narrowed it down to a few. Uh, there's bands here on Warp Tour that we're really interested in pairing up with for the fall, but um, you know, it's sort of just meeting people yeah, and we'll hanging out with goes. people and saying hey what's up what are you doing in the fall like exactly any chance you would want to come out with us that it's the possibilities are endless here it's a networking dream that's true that's mm -hmm. true you cannot complain uh you want to give out any uh words to your fans your viewers yeah man uh just the new album recorded in uh texas at uh sonic ranch torneo texas with paul leary of the butthole surfers pacifier's fourth studio album uh, we feel it's our most accomplished uh, work of art so far, and we're really, really stoked to put it out. So that's really all I can continue to say is cool. just check out the album in September. Uh, check out NearGenius.com. This is a Near Genius t-shirt right here. They're hosting all of our videos and photos for the summer. All right. So if you want to see what's going on with Pacifier this summer, log into NearGenius.com and check us out. We got, a, we got our own page on there with videos and updates and tour dates and stuff. So Thanks for hanging out with us this year at Vans Warped Tour 2011. Uh, be sure to subscribe to Punk Videos Rock on YouTube. And also, if you or a friend are struggling with depression, with addiction, or even self-injury, be sure to check out our good friends at Try Love In Her Arms.